going to be talking about the hand rest, also known as the crutch. This little item, which looks like an apostrophe on a peg, fits into the boot joint of the bassoon. The purpose of the hand rest or crutch is to create good hand posture so that the hand, the right hand specifically, fits directly over the thumb keys, the B flat, the pancake, and the F sharp, while meeting uh, the tone holes of the front right hand. This is especially helpful for bassoonists with large hands or that are having a hard time getting the posture correct. Um, oftentimes I see students balancing their thumb um, above the B-flat key on the metal. Now this is considered a bit of a no-no in the bassoon world, largely because it will slow down the technique. Some professors will stick tape there so that every time a student will uh, rest their thumb there, they will stick and it will be a reminder that their thumb should be uh, hovering direct directly above the thumb keys. Other professors that are not so nice will use a piece of tape with a thumbtack stuck into it so that uh, the thumb, again, every time it rests there, does not just stick, but it's actually pricked a little bit. Um, I find a little piece of double-sided sticky tape usually does the job, or possibly using a hand rest will fix the uh, improper posture. The hand rest can equally be helpful for when a bassoonist stands up. Standing up with the bassoon puts a large amount of weight on the left hand as that is the hand and arm that is holding the weight of the instrument. By using the hand rest, it gives a bit of an anchoring and a way to pull the bassoon back so that the right hand is also uh, carrying a large portion of the weight. All that being said, here's the secret. I do not play with a hand rest. Most of the playing that I do is sitting down and I do not rest my thumb above uh, the B flat key, so I don't quite have this problem. Um, also, my hands are relatively small. For those of you who know me, you know I don't play contra for extended hours on end, largely because my hands will start to cramp because they're uh, actually meant for the bassoon. They're of smaller size. Um, so that being said, I don't play with a hand rest but other people find them extremely helpful. It's more of a based on the physicality of the body. If you are taller, if you have longer hands, or if you're having a hard time with hand posture, use a hand rest, it could be a great asset to you. Also, if you're playing standing up and your left arm or your shoulder is starting to hurt on the front of it, play with a hand rest, okay? It's an option that you want to have available and open to you, but it's not necessarily required. Okay guys, I hope you found this helpful and that you uh, have some ideas on whether or not you should be including the hand rest or crutch in your basic bassooning everyday skills. I hope to see you guys next time and be sure to uh, subscribe so that you never miss a video and that you give this video a thumbs up. Happy bassooning! Bye!